Could you state what church you belong to? Or uh, I'm the pastor of St. Mark's Episcopal Church on Collingwood Boulevard in Toledo. And I mean, a lot of people have issues with those couple of verses in the Bible. But I mean, how does the, the Episcopal Church view them? Um, the Episcopal Church. Well, the Episcopal Church is so has so much variety that there are some people that do believe in really literal interpretation of the Bible, and there are some people that uh, believe in a less literal interpretation of the Bible. Uh, and so the churches that have uh, chosen to to really um, view the Bible critically realize that those parts of the Bible writ were written to speak to specific people in a specific time. And while the Bible is very valuable guidance for us, um, you have to recognize that there were issues present then that are not issues now. Like temple prostitutes? Temple prostitutes, you know, or if you talk about the Levitical codes, um, you know, we don't follow all the Levitical codes. There's 611 of them. Most yeah. of us don't keep kosher. Um, most of us wear clothes of mixed fiber. Most of us have our ears pierced. Yeah. Um, so why choose specific things and then not embrace the whole world? And if you, and if somebody asks you, like, hey, I'm a parent and I think my kid might be gay, what would you say to them? Um, I'd probably tell them to come make an appointment to talk to me, but um, I'd say, you know, you need to, to support your child, embrace your child, and um, give them what they need to, to be fully human and, and know who they are. Thank you very much. You're welcome.